How to fix the unable to load remote content error in mail, iOS 15. Manually load the content. When you get the unable to load remote content privately error in mail app, the fastest way to see the content is to tap on the load content button. It will then load the images and other files in the email. The downside of this fix is that your IP address becomes visible to the sender of the email. If you want to keep your IP address private, you can use a VPN. It will load the files by protecting the IP. This method also doesn't fix the main reason it works only as a temporary fix. Disable mail privacy protection. Go to your settings app. Scroll down and tap on mail. Tap on privacy protection. Next to protect mail activity, toggle the switch to disable the feature. Turn on iCloud private relay. Open the settings app. Tap on Wi-Fi. Next to your network, tap on the information icon. Next to limit IP address tracking or iCloud private relay, toggle the switch to enable the feature. On iPhones with Face ID, swipe up from the middle bottom. On iPhones with a home button, double press it. Locate the mail app and swipe up to force quit it. Reopen the mail app and check if the error is gone. Check the VPN, firewall settings. Sometimes your VPN or firewall can interfere with the mail app and cause the load content error. First, try to move the mail app to the safe list so the software lets mail function properly. If moving mail to the safe list didn't help, or you're not able to move it there, another thing you can try is to disable your VPN or firewall. Update your iPhone. Open the settings app on your iPhone. Go to general settings. Tap on software update. Wait while your iPhone searches for updates. If found any, tap on download and install. Contact Apple support. If nothing helps, we recommend you contact Apple support for further assistance. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. The Disk Cleaner option will scan your computer for app caches, logs, downloaded files, and files still sitting in the trash. It will also show you how much space what files to take up on your Mac. Combo Cleaner will also help you look through all big files on your Mac and delete those you don't need. You can also scan Mac for duplicate files, Sometimes you might not know that you have a few copies of the same file. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. And an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.